Well, this is a bit of an impromptu video. Uh, I was curious as to how well my OU 2901 uh, sol soldering station would perform. So I've uh, just uh, put a thermo couple on the tip of it, and uh, as you might be able to see, it's sitting at just about uh, 330 degrees. And uh, here I've got uh, a quite heavy duty power supply board, which is a dual layer board. We've got uh, this uh, ground uh, plane on both sides, it's pretty much the same size. Uh, all over. I figured we'd just uh, uh, put this onto the board and see what happens to the tip temperature. And it's a pretty big tip, it's uh, the 5mm wide one. I use this for heavy work. So let's just put some solder on there and put it there. And the tip's dropping to about 200 and something. And the board is now taking solder just fine. And now the tip is rising back up towards the set temperature. And this is what, why I, <laughs> I'm a major shill for these stations, because, because you've got this really super tight thermal regulation loop. So you can just pump power into these boards at will. You know, everything's just getting hot. I can put it to that joint, I can put it to that joint. And, you know, we're, we're pushing so much power into this board, but I can still put solder over there. Now it's starting to cool down a bit. And there's really not much overshoot when you take it off either, because you've got that tight loop since the... On these stations, the heater is uh, the same unit as the uh, tip, so you've got the heater sitting right here, and it's got a, a super tight thermal coupling to the actual tip. I don't know where my thermal couple came up, but I suppose we've got our results. Yeah, I really like these stations. I hope that just showed you just a bit of why I do. And just for the hell of it, let's uh, do the same thing with this little tiny uh, ball point tip. This is the tip I got for the soldering iron. Uh, it's just the smallest tip you can get for these, basically. Now, I've flipped the boards where we're in the opposite corner, so it's not. It's this is a room temperature part of the board, and this tip is going to have some issues transferring heat into the board since it's got a much smaller thermal uh, contact area. But the actual temperature of the tip is not dropping considerably less. Now th this tip was sitting at a slightly lower idle temperature but as you can see we are flowing solder just fine using this super tiny tip onto this massive massive board. If I, if I just put the thermocouple down towards the board yeah that's not going to show up properly. But yeah, the temperature is rising up towards 300 again. No problem. Cheerio.